Hello again, this is the Watering Man. Now I'm going to continue with the dissection, the explanation of John chapter 5, verse 4. Okay? <clears throat> now, <clears throat> I'm going to start out reading it from the King James Version. It says, For an angel went down at a certain season into the pool and troubled the water. <clears throat> Whoever, whosoever, then first after the troubling of the water stepped in was made whole of, whatsoever, of whatsoever disease he had. <clears throat> That's a mouthful, almost a tongue twister. <clears throat> <clears throat> for me. <laughs> uh. Sorry, my head's hurting just a little bit, but it's, it's draining outside. So, man. All right. Now. Wow, th this is kind of deep, so you, you might have to rewind it and play it a few times to try to get this. Okay, I, I, I'm trying Father, let this just articulate this out the best you can. Best that it come out of me, best I can, Father. <clears throat> now, in our mind, this big ball, universe of our thinking, when you go down to a single thought process, it expands up to another universe. The deep, deeper, and then expand it up to another universe, go down to another little tiny ball down in there, to another universe. And then that's filled full of little bitty balls, right? Now, <clears throat> so God's working down and throughout to change your heart, your mind, those little balls. They're in a state of duality, double-minded, soulless thinking. All kinds of fertilizer, manure, dirt thinking with the seed of Christ down in one tiniest, deepest ball. We'll call it a D3 ball. Deep, deeper, deepest. Third depth, if you will. Ball, okay? So this D3 ball down in there, the seed of Christ, in order to decrease this manure, use a little bit of this fertilizer that's like, you know, a plonk length, one, uh, like a one with 35 zeros after it, minus this plonk length size ball, the seed of Christ, inside that D, D3 ball, okay? Hmm? You got to take in the, um, you got a one here, and there's one with 35 zeros after it, Minus this one, okay? Now, to use up some of this, you hog tie it, your own ego, your own antichrist thinking, your own carnality, that's enmity, directly opposed to you going too towards it into God, ice. Huh? It, it tries to trick you with good and evil stuff. Ooh, yuck, it's manure, it's poop. Quit partaking of or eating your own yuck. Pee and poop, maggots, and flies, little raisins. But see, I like raisins in the natural. Not these kind of raisins, though. <laughs> Spiritually speaking. Ooh, maggots, flies. Lord of the fly thinking. The red way, okay? We'll call it just red, and this is a green. Christ. A green, emphatically, in hot pursuit. Everything you got coming into oneness, it's a right hand spinner. Remember that, right hand spin, you're coming into authority and power of God. God is your strength, your power, your authority. Huh? You're coming into E-N and S-Y-N, God, but you can't start, you got to germinate that seed first. You do that by, when God gives the pressures, boom, laying down this hog tie in your ego, and it must decrease, so it does it exponentially. It brings up to two to the zero power. It's duality. Two, a base of two, to a zero power, you're germinating. It comes to a one. You realize 
God is the rightful king. Now it's starting to go. You keep doing it. Again, two to the first. There's the two, then to the four, then to the eight, then the sixteen. This thing's going down at the same rate. Hmm? Decreasing. Your own ego must decrease and God's must increase. If you go this way, you feed this way, the broad way, you're going left-hand spins. Right-hand spin, left-hand spin. Authority in God, you're trying to make a stand in this crap. Huh? You got to choose. There is no right in the fence to try to stay double-minded. If you're doing that, you're like a lemon going over and being let off the cliff. You're going left-hand spin. <clears throat> Corruption to destruction, okay? I've been talking about stuff. Telling them, explaining them, okay? Now, <clears throat> in the natural, you can equate, <coughs> give you kind of a visualization. <coughs> <coughs> that junk out so I can go. go on. Okay. Now, in this ball, the tiny D three ball, tiniest ball, universe, 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 right? And there's there's like a myriad, an innumerable number. Okay. Alright. Now in this D three ball, third depth. There's, it's messed up. This was messed up too, my child. Here, let me help you. Splitting it out. He's spinning it up there. In the storms of your life. Not devil do it to you. God's bringing this. Huh? So that you can not agree with this thing. Agree with God and go up. Right hand spin. Hmm. God's your authority. Your strength is in God. You're made to stand in God. God is my exceeding great reward. This thing here says, left hand spin, it's anything but God. It's an alternative to going God's way. It's that A L L A, Allah, it says in there. Hmm? I think that's a quaintly Greek word. Okay? It's telling you. Good and evil ways. What do you think? And that's the left hand spin going down the toilet. Be like that swirly. Woo! Plop. Take it down into your own cesspool, right? Now, <clears throat> all the way down in that D3 ball, you, you, God's spinning this thing. <clears throat> Which way you choosing, my child? In the eye of the storm, you got to go God's way, in fact, in hot pursuit, becoming a poor widow woman to this way, and give it up, hog tie it, sock, duct tape, make a random mouth, make a muscle on that thing. Don't agree with it, don't make covenants with it, don't make empty promises. I'm gladly pay you Tuesday for a hamburger today. We're increasing God. <laughs> And you're going left hand spin. No covenants with it. Hog tie its hands and its feet. No working it out. No trying to live it out. No trying to suppress it. No nothing. You're doing nothing, dog. Be still. Right? Put them on as one. Hog tie that sucker. That beast stature. Your own beast stature. Take care of your own self, your own backyard, your own mind. Work out your own salvation. Not with fear and trembling. That's this thing. God's a big bad bully and you better fear him. Hold tight. Hold tight, this sucker. In your own mind. In your own mind. <clears throat> God's giving you an opportunity. Come up to him. Be reasonable and sit his way. That's the narrowing path to this funnel of correction. Don't go the broad way. Down into this destruction. Corruption, okay? Many will go that way, okay? We gotta spring you up, okay? This is in the D3 of your mind. The deepest. 
okay? Now, <clears throat> to give you a visualization of how small, like it's like a plunk length out of like a, if you stretch a, a just a diameter, a ball of a diameter from Earth to the Alpha Centauri system, the three stars out there, okay? Uh, around 4.25, 4.3 light years, okay? The light year is 5.22 or 5.88 trillion miles. Move that decimal place 12 times to the right. Oh my goodness. 5.88 and then move it 12 times. It's big. All right. And we're dealing all the way down into, if you relate that, that would be in the natural, be like that ball, that big ball, being like one proton. And then that little grain out of that sand, out of the whole volume of that thing, would be like the seed of Christ. Be like a plunk wave. And that's in the D3, the deepest depths of your mind. And that's in your thinking. Can't even touch it with natural, tangible stuff. It's not in the physical form stuff. Hmm. And even an adulterous generation. Or age seeks for a sign, but none will be given except the sign of Jonah, of the prophet Jonah. Just do it. Do you believe me? God's given his argument, his explanation, and intensification. Proved it in the secret place, in the deepest, deep, deep, deep D3 in your thinking. Down throughout. He's changing your mind. He's like the, the master surgeon. He's wanting to cut this foreskin out of your heart in the D3 thinking. Okay? <clears throat> now, the stirring of the water. Your mind, that's the thought processes. That hoodoo, that flood of your natural thinking. As you're building, as he's reassembling his bond, his arc, to lift you up above. That floods of this carnal stuff. This ego must decrease and God must increase. This thing's getting solider, denser, more glorious. Dense in his way, dense character. That's what's going to be able to go through the eye of the needle back to God's ways, back to the love of God. Nuclear fusion. It starts out in nuclear fission. It's got to be split. Oh my. This is out of like a whole universe, uh, like say in the visible, observable universe in your mind, like the big ball D1 ball, or universe ball, I mean, huh? Well, the whole capacity of your mind to think down to the single thought process D2, D3, and it's just got a whole universe like in there, huh? One, two, three, depth. All kinds of messed up balls in there. Hmm? Oh my. That that is equating to like this natural observable universe, which is saying it's about ninety three billion light years. Ninety three with nine zeros after a billion. And light years five point eight eight moved the decimal point uh, twelve times a trillion. And in a mile, five point or five thousand two hundred eighty feet, we're talking in the size of protons all the way down in there. And then inside that, it's a seed that's like out of plant place. From the Earth to Alpha Centauri, that whole ball and the whole volume in there, the seed of Christ. And he's working all the way down in there. That would just be equating the natural to the spiritual. The spiritual, way on beyond that. You can't possibly touch it. So God's getting it down and through out. So from this higher, out past this, your understanding, possibility. God's ways are higher than our ways. It's like out past the observable universe, if you will. But it's all tied together. All the way down and throughout it. Even all the way down to the single proton. And that's like a that whole big ball from the Earth to Alpha Centauri system. 
like about 4.25, 4.3 light years. And this little grain of sand in that all the way out to like the 93B. Same type of gods down throughout it. Christ, how much of God do you want? How much are you willing to agree with him? Are you willing to take up your bed and walk to live, to exist, to exist, to exist, back into the right-mindedness of God, to the love of God, like a, a split. Burp, this thing's going down, this is going up. Burp, not going down, you old crap it, bop, bop. Down the old stairs. Oh, left hand turns, now you're going right hand. Burp, righty tighty, right up to God. Like right hand threads. Huh? Not a left handed thread. That's going in. You don't shit it. Bop, bop. Right? You're sitting here and taste out your spell with your ego in the way. Don't eat them poop hot dogs, right? Come up. God give you the return, the ability to love God as He first loved you. To meet His child. His inexhaustible love that goes beyond the mere description of words. Boom! Nuclear fusion is taken, and that goes through the eye of the needle. The densest, most powerful, God's ways. E M S Y N God come through that eye, of the, following down to a singularity, and boom, through the eye of the needle, and out to a whole other way of being, existing. Only spirit can go to the Father. You can't destroy energy in the natural. You can't destroy the spirit of God. His flesh, flesh and blood stuff, flesh and way of thinking, these wants and desires. It's like grasping after the wind with your works, your hand. It's like grasping after the wind, like King Solomon said. You're grasping after the wind, you open it up, ain't nothing there. Your works, your efforts. You're trying to exist, exist, exist in your own ways. You're going down the shitter. Hmm? Plum worthless, plum insane. He's insane in the brain. Insane in the membrane. Insane in his brain. He's becoming more callous by doing it more and more. Get used to this crap. Literally. Crap thinking. Hmm? He's becoming a crap head. <laughs> Don't become a craphead. Right? Rubberized concrete. Huh? Right? Can't destroy the seed of Christ, but you're trying to bury it and make it into rubberized concrete. No way you can even get to this stuff. That's your own stinking thinking. It's not some enemy outside of you. Huh? Deception comes from within. I believe that was in uh, Mark chapter 7, verse uh, something like 1 through 23, 24, somewhere in there. A whole thing. Study it. Don't just skim it. Study it, study it, study it. Live it, live it, live it. May God reveal it, reveal it, reveal it. Bring the apocalypse, the apocalypse. The revealing of the truth before known. God loves you beyond the mere description of words. Not this sucker. Tell me, go the monster. Booyah, right? Now, <clears throat> the immensity, the thoroughness, the omnipresence of God, all the way down in the D3 depth, the seed of Christ is in there. All the way out to the whole observable universe of your mind. The cosmos thinking, K-O-S-M-O-S, the orderly arrangement in your mind. From the D1 to the D3 and beyond. God's ways are beyond that observable universe. Boom, let him bring you into that. E-N and S-Y-N. Boom, the ability to do that new universe. Another higher dimension. Way beyond this, you can't even conceive it. You want to just stomp the crap out of somebody if they do anything. I love you, man. Hiccup. If you do something against me, man, I'm going to tear you up. And that's a good thing.
You know you gotta make a stand in your own bubble, bubble, bubble. I'm a bainty rooster. You're dumb, but dumb donkey thinking, doing down your own crapper. Stop it, stupid. Right, you gotta tell yourself that. Muzzle, duct tape, that God you. In fact, die to yourself. Become a poor widow woman to that way. Let your old Adamic nature die. In other words, your Antichrist thinking, beat it, dog. Just beat it. Just beat it. Ow! Go on ahead and get out of here. I don't have to listen to what you say. I don't really care what you say is good or bad. So beat it. Because you're not God, you man. You're my own mankind thinking. Just beat it. Beat it. Go on ahead and beat it. I think you're funky. I think you stink. It doesn't matter what you think. So beat it. Just beat it. Ah, get out of here, dog. Zap, zap, zap. Right? You dumbass doggy. That's your own. Based on you. Get out of here, you rules and regulations that you're destroying God's promises. You're making it into rules. It's a log. Beat that stuff out. And God's giving you the opportunity. It's not to destroy you, it's to give you the opportunity. In those storms of life, God's stirring the pot, like so to speak. Plumb down in your deepest thinking. Like stirring up the water. Which way are you going, my child? You want right? Right hand, come up, seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, his love, God's ways. Or you on this left hand ways. Your own poop thinking or God's right right mind is the fruit from the tree of the knowledge of your own good and evil ways. Good, bad, and ugly. It's all done for winning Christ. We're going Christ. Hog tie, hog tie, hog tie, baby. Right? Now, so, just like that plonk lens, being like a grain of sand out of a ball stretching from the earth to the Alpha Centauri system, those three stars, four and a quarter, four and three, 4.3 light years, giving you a ballpark, just a way to kind of visualize it. It's so large, and that's the closest star system in the natural. Oh, what they can observe, and it goes beyond that. Hmm? Oh, my goodness, the more that you know, the more that you know that you don't know. God's opening it up. Oh my, that's just a natural thing teaching about the spiritual. Only down the deepest, deepest, deepest. It's messed up. Let me stir that water up. However, God wants to. He's using here, it says, a messenger, an angel, a messenger, a pastor, someone to guide you. To direct you. Not to get rich. Huh? Oh my. You to help them. They need need help, yes. But that's not the purpose. It's to help you. So you can understand. Oh, I'm, this is the way. Not this thing because it's more subtle. That serpent nature is more subtle than any beast in your field. There's two in this field. Antichrist thinking, red dog, ooh yuck, doo doo don't don't, JB sight thinking, and all that crap. All those giants in your land. And Christ, no God's way. Bop.
right hand threads, right hand spin, or left hand spin. All right, now eye of that storm. Which way are you going? Choose. Can't ride the fence. You just sore crotch. Go down your own poop. All right. So, and that's what I'm naming this. I'm going to see how I could put it in there. It only gives me so many spots. The water man. God is spinning the deepest ball of your mind, of one's mind. In the storms of life. Have a great day. Hit like and subscribe and comment. Encourage me as I'm encouraging you. I can use it. But I'm going to keep going no matter what. As long as I can. Some, sometimes it's a little overpowering. And I got the cartoon stars. Kind of evaporate and stuff. But. I'll do the best I can. Have a great day. Bye-bye.